in the dressing room, let's have a good, clean fight. Listen to my command. Protect yourself at all times. Good luck. That's what tonight is about. Here is the introduction to the monster. And he's called the monster, Andre, because of his knockout power than any other top fighter in the world. And lands the second most per round of any top fighter in the world, exceeded only behind the jab, like you just mentioned. So that's definitely an asset. And he hasn't uncurled that one quite yet. Just missed with one. The world has their eyes peeled right now on this fight. Because Inoue, those who have seen him until a couple of times, and he leads with the left hook. Well, he's fundamentally sound, and that power he has an idea of what he wants to do in there, which is saying all the right things. I just don't know if he can translate that physically. Tries to deliver the body. In a way, did a great job. Has to punch with in a way to get his shot in there first. And this is where in a way has had his way so far. So. Inoue wants to wait a little bit to punch sometimes. Punch in between when he's waiting. Or you wait for him. Because obviously you can get caught with a clean shot. Good shot from Nieves. Right hand by Nieves to the body. Inoue and he's been a little bit wide. But you can see the force that Inoue throws with. The power fight. So he has had one knockdown scored against him. Although he says it wasn't because of a punch. Now he goes downstairs and comes back up. There's and him. fires the left hook to the body with authority. Vicious left hand to the body. Boy, he hits like a lightweight, <laughs> and that's a compliment. <laughs> Won the first fight for Juan Francisco Estrada. It was having his feet flat on the canvas and maximizing the power in his punches. That's what his opponent tries to do. And I think he bothered Nieves with that hard right hand off the jab. Yeah, the other guy's coming down from 122 pounds. You know, the, 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 the guy coming overwhelming offense anyway. Just a little bit. Left hand to the body. Placement rather than power. Now combinations. Like a warning clap in front of the bell. That saved Nieves right there. The official timekeeper here, Tiffany, will believe that the round must be over. She makes a lot of noise when she does it. It's good. It's very professional. But if you ask him for driver's license back in Bangkok. Three. Of a schedule 12, you can see that Harold Letterman, unofficially, not surprisingly, has now in a way winning the first to see how hurt he still is. You see why he's called the monster. When a guy has fast hands, a good did something you occasionally see Gennady Golovkin do. He saw the target and adjusted the arc of the punch as it was traveling through the air. Punches and doesn't always use kind of classic technical defense. You think that'll be a problem against the next level? He'll have to make those adjustments and modify his style. A lot of time between now and then, though. <laughs> his opponents previous to this night. He has an Ike Corte-like jab, very piston-like, which are discouraging to Nieves. Well, you can happen toward the end of the last round, and you can see Nieves' confidence the game plan can go out the window quick. All of a sudden, it's yeah. part of the key to his ability to do that is balance and timing. He seems to always to be in the right position on his feet, and he throws when he wasn't his plan to do so. Absolutely. He's a pick him tight puncher until he gets his guy hurt, and then he throws in combination. I like that. Uh, accuracy. See that? I, I mean, maybe he's got his hands held up high, and Inoue still gets that jab through. Because what's impressive about Inoue is, he, and yet it's coming out wrong because of what Inoue is not working, but come up with a better one right now. I mean, the trainer's doing what he can do. He, he can only... But I don't know what his options are as a trainer in that. What would you want to hear in the corner? I'm not in that position because <laughs> well, you're in the position that Nieves is a tough and unenviable position like you just mentioned to be in. Way for Nieves, he works at a PNC. His banking career goes forward, and he said, I'm never going to give up my day job. Boxing is big. It's a big part of my life. Uh, anyway, it seemed to me took the first minute of this round off to allow Nieves to throw some punches and let Nieves into an exchange where he wouldn't have to try to open Nieves' defense. He could just, you know, catch him with in an exchange. An average of 37 coming in. He's throwing 41 jabs per round here tonight. Now, listen to me. We know that we have an opportunity now. Father fighter connection. The, the sport's most famous duos, including, of course, Felix Trinidad and his son. There are emotional implications when the father. I think Inoue has to put Nieves away here in this round or next. 
and really look devastating. Makes some water cooler buzz the next, you know, on Monday at work. And he's trying to find somewhere to hide in the ring, and he can't find it. As Inoue continues to track him down, pin him against the ropes. Kovalev, when you saw that, you went right there, and here Inoue has him ready to go to the body. Yep, there it is. First time down Six, as a pro for Nevis. First time eight, in the ring with a nine, fighter like okay. now right. yet in a way. Now why throw any throw another punch other than a hook to the body? And there's another one. one and there's one another one. one. Another, one. Uh, another left hook to the body. Another left hook to the body. In a way, trying to finish the fight in with boxing. It. I don't care who you are, who and you're second. fighting, where you've been brought up. Learn to throw the left. We're just waiting for the final hook to the body to end things. I don't know what wounded prey in front of him. So he's going to continue to throw that left hook to the body, and it's hiding the fact that he wants to throw that left to the body. So Nieves has enough experience where he can guard against that shot. He's got to switch it up, throw a right to the body. Listen to the sound when those left-hand body shots land. You can hear that all over the arena here at the stud. Keeping that right hand glued to his side right there. That's why you got to switch it up. If you want that shot, you got to go away and then come back from me. In the ring, come to me, come to me. I'm ready for the match. The referee has to get keep a close look on the Evans. And me. one and two. His first loss in the last fight was a decision with which he was still in the fight. But if you know what you're looking at, he's had enough to get worse as this fight progresses. Big right, right hand, hand to the body. From in a way, right what a vicious. Who knows what's going on internally in his rib cage? Where trainer Joseph Delguide has a decision to make, and he has made the decision. Yeah, his corner stopped it. That's good. A lot of corners would have let the guy go out again. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dr. Lou Moret, after the indication from the corner of the challenger, has to call a halt to the contest. The winner and still undefeated and still the reigning and defending WBO super flyweight champion of the world, Naoya Monster.